Hey guys, welcome to Plants vs. Zombies. I know this seems very odd, but I just really want to make a let's play of this for once because, well, it's an OG and if Respawn can play it, so can I. So, I wish I was going to wait longer until World 7, but nah, I'm just too impatient. And yes, this is the DLC mod, not the um, other thing, so we're just going to get straight into this. Why the DLC mod? Well, more content. Sweet. Oh ho ho, yes. No, we ain't doing that. We're gonna enjoy all this. Yes, very nice. So, I did test this out before I make a let's play on it. And while it, it was lagging a bit, it was actually lagging a lot. And that makes me kind of worried that this will start lagging but I actually decided to change move this thing to a different drive so hopefully that changes it a bit probably and the reason also reason why I want to do this because I just want to chill I just want some of those videos where I can just chill a bit and talk about stuff because I never have a chance to do that do that in piggy games of all things so I just want to talk about uh well I guess what's What's coming up? Some news about stuff. So FNAF 2 filming. That's all fun. We got Sunflower now. Alright, now we got level 2 with lots of more zombies. So... Um, what else I want to say? So, you remember how I came come on this? How I f discovered this? Uh, I of Z because of Zaxod. Though even though I discovered the sequel first before the first one. And I do plan on playing the Collisionist Carnival for PvC 2 We Flourish whenever that comes out. And the reason why is because I thought it would be a best way to set up Secret of the Mimic. Because they both take place in Carnival. Isk areas. And what else I want to talk about? Um... I don't know. Maybe f let's talk about Secret of Mimic. In fact, let's theorize. Because my theory is that it comes out in May. Depending on whenever we get another trailer, which I hope it's um soon. Parmy thinks we're gonna get the next trailer during the um game awards that comes out this summer, which hopefully will have not only a FNAF trailer, but also a Kingdom Hearts 4 trailer, because I think we're long due over a Kingdom Hearts 4 trailer. And what else I want to talk about? I guess we can extend our talk we did about a, a Hawkeye season two. The reason why I want to talk about that is because, well, it was just such a cool idea, and I'm being, I guess I am kind of selfish because Hawkeye is my second favorite. Well, Kate Bishop specifically is my second favorite um, superhero in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but I don't know, it just felt like a nice idea. Just use Hawkeye Season 2 as, as like a Avengers, uh, Young Avengers type show. I mean, people said they wanted one, might as well make Hawkeye Season 2 that. But of course they never did, which is very upsetting. I don't know what made them thought they that wasn't a cool option, it definitely was. And... Just wish it existed. It came out this year. Alright, now, yeah, Conehead Boys, that's all fun and such. I'm not sure how many mo levels I want to do. Depend how quick we do this, I think maybe like... Maybe 10, all 10, or 5. I think maybe I'll just set it out for 5. Yeah, that seems fair. Each... Two... Um, two somethings for each world. <laughs> two something. Five levels each video. Yeah, that makes sense. And this is going to be very fun because we're going to be including World 6. Which I'm very excited about. I'm also not going to be using the speed thing or the... The, what you call it? The, 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 the... The something something. 
Oh yeah, the the boosts. Because I kind of want to save my money for slots because that's all the mm, the thing I usually like focusing on is the slots because as you can see, we only have like six of these. And it would be a lot better if we had more of them. If we're being honest. Because there's no way I'm making out of this game with slots. So if I were to be focusing my money on something, it would be on slots. And nothing else. And... The only thing I really like to say is just... Like again, how chill this is. Because the second game, it's not chill at all. It's not. I mean, you could... You can still, um, I'd say, slow down and prepare anything. Well, at least in, until F Lost City, where that thing is just, just trashes on you with lots of stuff. That's honestly why I prefer we floors, because they actually let you take your time to set up everything. Lost City through Modern Day does not do any of that, which is why I have a love-hate relationship with those worlds. In fact, Neon Mixer Tour is my... Favorite world, but it has a crappy level design. Like, just super crappy stuff. Not a fan of it at all. Would I make a let's play of the entirety of PVC 2 we flourished? Uh, that'd be like in years, because I already replayed the game like two times. Well, the entire game. Not just the we flourished content, and... Oh, it is not a good experience. Especially when you get to stuff like Lost City and Neo Mixer Toy. It's just... Terrible. And I had to do it without any premium, so so it was just worse. And to actually try to use the plants from those specific worlds, so I didn't have a fun time doing any of that at all. <laughs> oh look, this walnut, very fun. Great. Now we get this next level. We yes, more cone heads and such. Oh god. Oh god, this is so just. Oh god, five lanes. This looks so big compared to PVZ2. PVZ2, it looked- the five lights looked small, but now looking at this. Oh, it's big. It's- it's very big. Anyways, let's talk about Puppy Playtime. By Yarnaby. Yes, Mr. Yarnaby boy. <laughs> so, about Yarnaby. Um... I don't know, honestly. He's a cool guy. Yeah, he's a cool guy. Not exactly, um... Oh my god, just realized. What am I doing? I'm focusing too much on... There we go. Let's actually put a walnut. Uh, we'll put one here. That should be good enough. I mean, you... I just realized I didn't use cherry bomb at all last episode. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh, kind of sad. <laughs> Anyways... About Puppy Playtime, Chapter 4. I am so excited for Chapter 4 and how it's going to be even bigger and harder than Chapter something something. And... And do we... I guess I can explain more in depth of why I want the Doe Man as the main villain. Because I've said multiple times that I want the Doe Man to be the main villain. And that's because... Well... Plato. Plato was a huge impact of my life back then. I just want to fight it. I want to have a big ultra ultimate battle against it. <laughs> it that just sounds so much fun. So I'm really hoping Yonabi is not the main villain, but still has like a big role. And it's just the like the uh, and it's just the dome man. I mean, I'll be fine if Yonabi if Yonabi is the villain, then sure, I'll have to accept that, and I'll, and I'll be fine. But the domain would just be really cool. And I'm interested to see how Piano Source is, is gonna play off. Because I'm pretty sure he's gonna be the next person to get revealed. And... He's gonna be something of a threat. I don't know exactly what. Maybe there'll be like some melody and memory type sequence. Kind of like the Bunzo thing where... Or no. I don't know how the piano source is gonna work at all. I there is one thing I like about piano source that I don't think I've mentioned yet. He's actually based off a Spinosaurus and not a Tyrannosaurus Rex, which I love very much because one of the very underrated dinosaurs, in my opinion, is a Spinosaurus. Remember why? Because 
He's more dangerous than a T-Rex. We see that in Jurassic Park 3. And the fact that the Spinosaurus is, is only time where he only shines in Jurassic Park 3 is kind of um sad. So I'm really excited to see him shine again as a piano for some reason. It it sounds odd, but that's how <laughs> but that's how it's gonna be. Alright, um we're almost done with this level. So after this one we don't get a shovel. Oh my god, look at all that sun. Yay. You know what? Um do this. It it won't make an effect, but it's something. Yay, none of my walnuts were scratched. Oh look, shovels. Oh, here we go. Greetings, neighbor. My name's Crazy Dave, but you can just call me Crazy Dave. Listen, I got a surprise for you. But first, I'll need you to clear your along. Your you use uh, your shovel and dig up those plants. Let the digging commence. Oh yeah. Up, up, da, ha, ha. Oh goody, now for the surprise. We're going bowling. Here, take this walnut. Why put a walnut in your hand? Because I'm crazy. Now go, bowl me a winner. Oh great, here we go. Oh, this is bowling, yes. This is very fun. I don't know why I put them in the bag. You can just honestly put them here. Yay, who doesn't love bowling? I actually have one question. Has anyone ever put this soundtrack while they're actually playing bowling? I'm quite curious to know if someone ever did. Anyways, while we're here, what else should we talk about? Maybe something related to Piggy? The Decay chapter? Nah, I want to talk about Branch Rats chapter 5. When I can potentially at least. My theory is February, just because how... How it just got revealed so early compared to... It got revealed during July, wasn't it? Yeah, July. And that to me just... That just screams like February release date. Because I'm pretty sure September we got our first look at Chapter 4. So that just leads to me thinking... Oh, uh, Chapter 5. Uh, coming very soon. Uh, February. Yeah, February is definitely gonna be the release date. Oh, I'm hoping we just give you another purple carpet premiere. That was so much fun to enter in. And I just realized I never made my video talk about my experience in it. That's, uh, that's quite sad. Uh, I don't know why I kept forgetting to do that. There's probably a reason why. But anyways, the Haunted Mall. I'm so excited, excited for this one. Also... Apparently people are saying that character we're playing as that uh, the pig that we saw in the end of the video is George. I don't really believe that because well, I mean, if it is George then cool, but we already had George as a playable character kinda. I don't think they would do George again. But that's just me. I'm not entirely sh Oh look, potato mine. Well, that's it this video. I hope you all enjoyed. I think we'll do uh, the rest of it um, in another video. Not sure when, but hopefully sometime this month. If you like this video, give it a like. Consider subscribing for more content like this, and I'll see you all next time. Bye, everybody.